I'm Alan Alda, and I'm here in the studio recording my new book, If I Understood You, Would I Have This Look on My Face? I think what helps me the most is simply remembering that this piece of machinery is not what I'm talking to. It enables me to talk to a real person, and I, I see, I imagine a real person. I don't see their face or know who they are, but I know there's a real person there. But then he said, what's the cross street? This was another flashpoint. I've never been there before, I thought. How am I supposed to know the cross street? Isn't that sort of your job? Ordinarily, I would start boiling again. Instead, I took out my iPhone and opened a map. I'm looking it up for you, I said. We were getting to be real teammates. The book is really all in the title. It's the hope that we can learn to talk to one another with understanding and communicate more effectively by paying attention to the person we're trying to communicate with. So much of what we hear about listening is that it's important to listen to understand somebody. It's really important to listen to be able to explain things to somebody. The person talking has to do more listening than the person listening. Music